Last night, the United States Congress may have reached a new low. You see, last night we had what's called a quorum vote. A quorum vote is essentially where you vote on whether you are present or not present. It is to determine which members of Congress are actually here for the purpose, the purpose of establishing a quorum. So we had this vote, this quorum vote last night, and we had 101 members of Congress vote present by proxy. So they had someone else vote for them, voting present, because they were not present. By definition, if you are voting by proxy, you are not present. This may be the height of our proxy voting absurdity right now. 101 members voting that they were present while admitting against interest because they were proxy voting that they were indeed not present, also lying in the process, saying they were not present. Remember, they have to sign their name saying they're not present because of the ongoing coronavirus emergency. That's not why they weren't present. In fact, we have members, a handful of members that are traveling with President Biden to Georgia today. I guarantee you some of them, them are going to vote proxy and say they can't be here because of the coronavirus pandemic, when in fact they can't be here because they're taking a political trip with President Biden to Georgia. So just let this sink in. 101 members of the House voted present by proxy. If this does not illustrate how stupid and damaging proxy voting is to this institution, I don't know what else will. And I guarantee you that when we take back the House, the first thing we'll do is get rid of this proxy voting scheme. Or at least that is the first thing we should do, because this is getting out of hand. Don't let your member of Congress proxy vote.